Hi everyone, welcome to the first episode of NOLA NOMS. This is the series where we break down all the delicious food and honestly, food capital of America and break it down based on how far away it is from Tulane's campus. My name is Ali DeFazio and I'm joined by my beautiful girlfriend, Dominique Dalmer. Yay, let's go. Hi everyone, Ali and Dominique here at our first Floyd spot. This place is the closest to campus. It's called Adam's Grocery. Here we go. What floor are you gonna get, Dominique? I have no idea. I'm usually a fried catfish type of Floyd Boy girl, but uh, we'll see my branch out today. Let's go. We have secured the goods. We're heading back to campus for a nice, nice five minute drive to get back to Tulane. Okay, we're on canvas, we're masking up. We decided to eat lunch behind Gibson right now. We have our tent set up for all our in-person visitors coming. So without further ado, let's get tasted. Okay, that is a really good sandwich. Oh boy, sorry. Okay, so I'm realizing now that we should have gotten napkins. Crucial mistake that we <laughs> just <I know>. made. <sighs> We've discussed on the score. <laughs> I got this shrimp, fried shrimp po' boy. I'm gonna give it a seven out of 10. The bread was delicious. Um, all of the dressings were really good. The fried shrimp, gulf shrimp was so good as always. The hot sausage um, po' boy, and I'm giving mine a 6.5 out of 10. I like my things to be saucy. I'm like big on flavor, big on sauces, but it was still really good. A really good bang for your buck. Super close to campus, which is so nice. Yeah, and I mean, we're tough critics because we live in New Orleans and there's so much good food here. Like, so much good food. Mm. <laughs> Hello everyone, Allie and Dominique here. As you can see, we've got the bike helmets on. We're gonna be biking to our next Boy Boy spot. So without further ado, let's go. Hey y'all, we just made it to our second Po' Boy Stop Parkway Bakery and Tavern. This is a really famous place, so we're super excited to get some Po' Boys and eat them on the bayou. Yes! We made it to the bayou. We're setting up our blanket right now. Okay, the moment is here. Uh, let me just like show a clip of this right now. Delicious. I don't know, Dominique. This is one of the best po' boys I've had. Mm -hmm. This, like truly, this is one of the best po' boys I've had in the city. Okay, final review of Parkway. We both ordered the James Brown, which was, a, it said spicy beef. Honestly, it was brisket. So it was brisket with uh, fried shrimp Mm, I give it a 9 out of 10. I'm gonna give it an 8.5 out of 10. I really like it, but it was marketed as spicy. <laughs> Not spicy. <laughs> a I common love, problem with that me. <laughs> I love spicy. <laughs> but overall, Parkway, oh, yet so again. Good. So good. Delicious. Hi everyone, Allie and Dominique back at you with our last po' boy spot in Nola Noms and we are going to Vertimart in the French Quarter. Let's go. <laughs> what they say about New Orleans is true. There really are just beads everywhere on the ground. Okay, coming out of the po' boy spot, got the goods. We got a fried catfish and a fried shrimp po' boy on deck. Okay, we are here across from Jackson Square. 
This is gonna be hard to rate, guys. Okay, we are heading home to announce the grand finale of Nolan Oz and what our favorite cold boy is. So uh, let's go, we have a pretty scenic ride right there. Oh boy, Adams Parkway or Verti Mart was the best. And we have to go with Park Parkway. <laughs> yeah, it's cool. Like, there are so many good po boys in New Orleans. The history of po boys, like a lot of other things in New Orleans, is really long. Oh, we have Boo here. Our cat wants us in it. <laughs> See, yeah, our cat wants our leftover po boys. We love some good leftover fried shrimp and catfish. We hope that you enjoyed the series and we hope to see y'all soon. Bye. <laughs>